Welcome to a short tutorial on how to check system stability with Intel Burn Test for either overclocked or undervolted systems. System stability is essential for being productive and in case of an overclocked or undervolted CPU, you want to know whether it is stable or not. Intel's MKL or Math Kernel Library is a benchmark pack for finding out just that. The Intel Burn Test that has been created by a person named Agent God simplifies the usage of said pack. You can download it on techpowerup.com, it is also linked in the description of this video. It is only for Windows users and has no distinctive versions for 32-bit and 64-bit systems. The program is zipped and its size is below 2 MB. After launching the Intel Burn Test v2.exe file, you will be greeted with a very unspectacular dialog box. The only things you can alter is the stress level, the amount of threads being used and the times to run. There are four predefined stress levels, standard, high, very high and maximum. Stress level number 5 is a custom one and you can select the RAM being used. For some reason, the detected RAM is roughly 20GB on my rig, although 32 are installed. That should however not scare you away. The pre-selected options are a good way to start. After running the standard stress test 10 times, you have a good feeling for the stress being put on your CPU. It is recommended to monitor your temperatures during the stress test. See your manufacturer's manual for maximum temperatures. If the temperature is getting too high though, you might experience thermal throttling. That will not be the case for most of you in standard stress level. Or at least it shouldn't be. In case you want to push your system, you can also select the extreme stress mode. That has been hidden behind the start button. Simply right click the start button, left click on extreme stress mode and then click start and watch your CPU literally burn. No, not burn, but your windows might not be usable during the time of stress testing and if it's too much for your system, you might also experience a reboot. No worries, today's systems won't take any damage, or at least it's very very unlikely, but of course it's not guaranteed. So use the extreme stress mode at your own risk. A nice addition to all of that is the freeze test section, meaning you have a burning flame and once your system freezes up, that flame is not moving anymore, so it's a good indicator for problems. In case your system is not stable, you will get feedback by either a reboot or severe temperature struggle. The benefits of using Intel Burn Test with the so-called Linpack in it is a lot less time that is required to find out if your system is stable or not, compared to Prime95 of course. For that we have a video in the info cards. It's also the same stress testing engine Intel is using for testing their CPUs before shipping them out. So this is how you use Intel Burn Test in a nutshell, like this video if you liked it, leave a comment down below, subscribe to the channel and we will see you in the next one.